Oh hey there, welcome to a new video with me, Paul, otherwise known as Golden FM. And what do you see before you here? In front of you, on the screen, yes, Championship Manager 2001, 2002 edition. What a game, what a legendary game. I bet the Pope even used to play this, this game back in the day. There's still people that religiously play this game, it's that good a game. There's a massive forum and website online um, about it and people still religiously play it despite the fact it's it's 14 15 14 well 14 years old isn't it 2001 it would have came out in end of 2001 so wow it's been going for years but it's still played by millions i'm sure maybe not millions but thousands around the world so how did i get this game <laughs> i won't tell you in this video i'm doing a tutorial on how to install and play this game for free legally for free if you've been with me on my Golden FM Twitter, over the past three years I've occasionally tweet tweeted out the link to this game and how to install it um, for free, legally for free. That's the key. So, yep, I'm going to do a tutorial. That'll be up half an hour after this video goes up, so in all likelihood when you click on my channel it should be there and you should be able to find it. I will put a link to it in the description below when it goes live so you can install it. Oh. I'm really hoping this is going to be a good series. It may only be one season, but I want to relive my youth. When this came out, I would have been 10, I guess, going on 10. I was born in 1991, so I was 10 years old when this came out, I guess. And oh, I loved it because I, I got this game for free in, well, the demo for free in a box of Cheerios. I, I'm sure there's many of you out there that would have done the same thing and then got hooked on this game and then eventually it led on to Football Manager. So that was an amazing marketing ploy from Sports Interactive or IDOS at the time I guess it was. Uh, yeah, amazing. So well done to them. It wasn't my first Championship Manager though. I did have the 9900 edition. As I've said in previous videos, that was a great game as well. In fact, I've got it over here. Ah oh, yes, prepared. <laughs> here it is, legendary game. Um, it doesn't work when I put it in my computer, which is why I'm playing on this one. But I think this is probably... I think more people prefer this one to 9900. I'm not sure, but I would probably say 0102 was the more popular one. So what I want you to do in this video, quite a simple thing, in the comments section below, I want you to let me know who I should manage. Bear in mind I may only do one season. I want it to be a big team with money. Because, quite simply, I, I want this series to be fun. I want us to, or I want to sign some championship manager legends from way back when, in the ye olde days. So, what I want you to do is suggest a team in the comment section below and say why I should manage them. Tell me why. So you could say, oh, for example, Real Madrid because they've got Ronaldo, the original Ronaldo. Did they have him at that point? Maybe. I can't remember. We're going to have a look at some teams in a second, so that might be able to sway you towards a certain team. Oh, I remember this. It's just, it's beautiful. If you're looking forward to this series, please smash that like button. I don't know anyone that ever used a password, unless maybe you're trying to protect your save from your brother or your sister who will delete it otherwise, maybe, or go onto your save and remove all your players. But wow, this is exciting. So I need to select a team. Can I start unemployed on this? I don't know, even know if I can start un unemployed. Well, I will join a team just for the sake of this video, but we'll look at a few different teams and then, uh, then you can decide who I should manage. So just for the sake of this video, I'm in charge of Gillingham, legendary team. I think they're in Division 1, which, which is actually the division below the Premiership at this time, wasn't it? So let's go and find a club. Uh, oh, we can search. We'll, we'll just search for Manchester United first of all, and we'll look at them. So they've got Barter, they've got Roy Carroll, what a legend. Look at the team. Laurent Blanc, Silvestra, Wes Brown, oh, Wes Brown. I could manage Man United simply because of Wes Brown. I could play Wes Brown, Nicky Butt, Darren Fletcher. Wow, he must be quite young on this. 17 years old, Darren Fletcher. This is exciting. I might do a video where I just look at some old players, like modern day players on 0102. If you're interested in that, let me know. But look at that strike force. Venice Dwight York, Andy Cole, 
maybe I could be Man United. I got Solskjaer still on Veron and Giggs at the age of 27 in his prime. Paul Scholes as well in his prime at the age of 26. Wonderful stuff. I suppose the other major team in England at that time was Arsenal. I think it was between Man United and Arsenal most years at this time, wasn't it? So, oh, they've got Matthew Upson in the squad at the age of 22. Wow. <laughs> Who else have they got? Tony Adams, Sol Campbell, Martin Keown, Steve Sidwell. 18-year-old Stephen Sidwell. I didn't. I actually didn't know he started at Arsenal. That's amazing. Will Tord. Oh, Francis Jeffers. 20 years old. Look at that. He looks quite good. Anticipation and break, uh, balance of 17 there. They're all in different orders, of course, aren't they? Like finishing 17. Wow. He he looks good, doesn't he? Here, yeah. Francis Jeffers. Ali Adier. Ah, oh, I should stop. You know, I should stop looking at this. I could do this for days. I could just do a video where I go round and look at random players. I might do that because I think some of you would actually find that quite interesting. How about Real Madrid then? Maybe you'd want me to manage Real Madrid because of Casillas. At the he's really young here, isn't he? Twenty years old, Casillas. And uh, who else? Oh, they got Cambiasso, Figo, Raúl up front. Or maybe they don't have Ronaldo. They've got Zidane though, haven't they? They've got Steve McManaman. He's 29 here. Ah, oh, great team. Roberto Carlos. Ah, oh, what a hero. I don't know if you can see this very well. Uh, I've had to make it really small on the screen to record and that's why I've got a bit of a background. But I don't know if you can see the numbers very well. And because there's backgrounds as well, like I'm sure there's a different way of installing different skins. I never used to do that when I was younger, but there's probably a way of turning off things. So I might do that if you can't see it very well. Let's look at Barcelona then. They've got Patrick Kluivert. He is a real legend. 25 on here. Saviola, 19 years old. I thought Kluivert was older, to be honest. When did he retire? He's got 34 goals in 54 games at the age of 25. That is incredible. Mark Overmars. See, what, on 1900 audition, he was at Arsenal, wasn't he? I think. Yeah, he was. Then he moved to Barcelona. They've got Carlos Puol. He's 23 on here. He won at the Spanish cap. Rivaldo. Oh. Wow, this is, this is just amazing. I love this already. Why didn't I do this sooner? We've got... Bayern Munich here, so you may want me to manage uh, Bayern Munich. Ah, oh, Nico Kovac, and uh, who else is there? Pizarro. What the hell? He's still there, isn't he? In real life, or has he just left? But he's been there for years. He's ancient. They've got some, they've got Rocky Santa Cruz, nineteen-year-old Rocky Santa Cruz. Oh, wow. Now, the Italian teams were very big at this point, weren't they? Inter Milan, AC Milan, Juventus. They've got Christian Vieri. What a what a striker he was. They've got some good players. And we're gonna, I, I will, I mean, if I do an episode of just looking at players, maybe looking at Wonder Kids, there'll be a, quite a few out there to look for, I guess. Because the, the, oh, these teams are lethal just realized the you have news thing has been flashing at me this whole time but just ignore that AC Milan oh that that would be a good team as well to manage I guess just let me know who you want me to manage oh Perlo 22 year old Perlo I can't see his stats but Inzaghi as well and Shevchenko oh unbelievable stuff I don't know how good Juventus were at the time they've got Buffon who will be yeah 23 20 caps for Italy already. But yeah, Trezeguet. They've got... Uh, Juventus were a big team, weren't they? So that that's it, to, for, to be honest, today, guys. I'm not going to be managing um, Gillingham. But <laughs> pick me a big team and let me know why you want me to manage them. It, it doesn't have to be one of the ones I showed. Just, just a big team from back then. And we'll take control of them and see how we can do in one year. I want to try and sign as many championship manager legends as possible for that team. It may require me having to sell certain players. But if you're interested in a certain team that you want me to manage, 
let me know. Please hit that like button if you're really looking forward to this series. That'd be much appreciated. Let's try and smash as many likes as possible for this. I don't know how many. 10,000, no. 10. 10 likes, yes. We can do that, I'm sure. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in episode 2 when I re will reveal the team. I will pick one of your suggestions in the uh, comment section below and go for it. And uh, yeah, see you then.